Hello friends and welcome to my YouTube channel. Hey, now my name is Jerry called Augusta Gold. For those of you who are not serving me, my name is Augusta Gold, the only Augusta Gold in the whole universe. <laughs> if I rap, you go switch ya. So um, let me go quick to the message I have for, for the gist what I get for now today. It's a quick one. So, but it's important to me, hence I'm trying to like quickly do it. So yesterday I saw a video of uh, patient Sezoku, Mama G, G for general, general in Aba, general in Enugu, general in all the Igbo village and all the place. <laughs> all of them know Mama G. Mama G is an actress, a Nigeria actress, a good one at that. You know, she was having this conversation with Messi Okoji, where they were doing Messi menu. This girl not the sweet me to shop. So, <laughs> so um, there's this part of the video that actually went. I mean, what went viral? We have patients were saying that after the death of her husband, um, she wanted to actually remarry, but it, it became too late, as in her children were grown, and they pleaded with her not to remarry, and then that they are going to be her husband, her this, her that. She accepted it, and then she did not get married. So um, there are many parts of her life after the death of her husband. She stayed single, not because she wants to, but because her children wants her to stay single. And then from the comment section, I saw where people were writing, where people were commenting. People said, some people said, what she did is very good. Others said, what, she, what um, the children did was selfish. You know, different kind of comments and uh, sentiments were poured into the comment section or the reply from the video she did. So me, I'm here this morning like this, so I cut up my parts. Mm -hmm. I don't say my parts, the only the guy be, the only the different. Because me, I dig his mountain differently. So, let me start by saying this. When I left my ex, eh, you know, when you leave broken, everything, all you know, the memories are still fresh on your head. I told myself that I was not going to regret it. I'm not going to marry. I'm not going to marry again. What I want to use my tent to. I don't need that. I know they marry. <laughs> you know, I was just doing kitty, kitty, kata, kata, doing other things, getting busy with my life. I said, I know they marry. Tell what they can do. They marry. What I want to use and do. Mm. If I want a uh, man, I go guess if I want to, I don't have to remarry. You know, that kind of thing. Talk with many women, they talk when. Either the husband die, either the ones when they say they get divorced, separated. That is what they say most time. Don't blame them. The reason why people say such things now mostly because of the experience where they don't get or where they get along the way. Now they made a day, yeah, like that. But as time goes on, some people change their mind. Why some don't? They just stay like that. Most women who decide to stay like that, um. And refuse to get married ever again are uh, actually the ones who lost a good man like um i am not saying those that got divorced the men are not good no the man may not be good to you but the man may be good to somebody else so nobody is completely useless so i'm not saying those men are not good what i mean by losing a losing a good man i mean maybe the man was very good to you you guys enjoyed your marriage together until one day suddenly this person just went to the great beyond the person move cow go meet jesus for a papa throne and hand those kind of people may like to say may say oh i want to live the remaining part of my life like this single especially listen especially when they are in africa is easier than when you are in the obodo Yibo country in the europe hmm. it's more difficult let me explain it's more difficult when you are in the obodo Yibo country why I talk I'm like that? In Nigeria, if you decide not to remarry in Nigeria, life still continues. Everything still goes. I don't know about the loneliness compared to the UK, but you have a social life. You they go church where you they see plenty of people. You for you they you get yeah, people around you. Muna umwada, umu everything there around you. You they go a meeting, meeting people, and they meet on herself, you know. There is, you have a life, you know, outside of being married, you still have a life. You still have a life in the sense that people can still even come and stay with you. You know, you know life generally is a bit easy. If you believe the woman is a bit grown, like Mama P, Mama P, you can just bring in children. If I live in the 
in the Nigeria um, Buari country like this now. And I, like I am now, I can add more children to my children. The way I am, at least I can feed more than my children. So I can easily add other children. I think, oh, this child is struggling. The mother is struggling to take care of this child. Let me collect the child and add to my children, you know. And that will keep your house warm, busy, you know, and all that. But in the, the Oyibo country, it is, it is not like that. So when your children grow, like in Nigeria now, in the Buari country, when your children grow up and leave the house, children, other children will come in, relative and all that, you bring them in. But in the Obodo Yibo country, it is not like that. When your children grow up and leave your house, and they leave very early, oh, not be like Nigeria, where we say, picking, do we say they 20 something, see they your house. Yeah, they, they live very early. Picking never reach 18 years, so they won't come out. So when your children grow up and leave your house, Omo, you know they call loneliness. What can really loneliness see? You go see loneliness, you go know yourself. You go know yourself. There is is lonely in the abroad. So living in the abroad, whether your partner by you, whether you separate or whether you divorce or whatever happens, Omo, you go one remarry. Okay. I was saying something initially. I said. Initially, that's how they do initial grab grab. I will not get married again. What thing I want to cut do until COVID now struck. God won't come use COVID to drama. Yes, I'm gonna. Oh, yeah, me. God won't come tell me, say, no, be so I create you. COVID come come. As COVID come come, that year Christmas, they don't open road to make everybody do Christmas, you know, normally. So my own be say, normally, if my children go do Christmas or then go visit their papa, me too. I will meet a friend, you know. Sometimes I just go to London. I get friends for different places. I'll just decide where I won't go, whether that London, Manchester, Liverpool, wherever. I will plan them. I'll go go. Oh my that year, I don't buy ticket to finish. I want to travel. Not be seen abroad outside the UK, within the UK, sha. I don't buy ticket finish. My children left in the afternoon. I was supposed to leave the following day. <laughs> that evening, my children left around midday. That evening, I was just doing a live video here. Now I see message for my phone. The message looks strange. Now I pause the video. Now I open the. Now I just swipe down to see the message. Hey, hey, Jesus, Now I see say, uh, what did they call him? Boris Johnson. Don't lock the country. My children don't go holiday. Boris Johnson. Don't lock the country. Only me inside this house. Christmas. Everything. Everything I did. Omo. Um, uh, Initially, they do video, they switch me. You know, I was busy with social media. When they come reach evening, the next day, I'm not worried. I, I be, as I be doing, I be introvert. You know, forget all this, my gra, -gra. I be introvert. Even if I won't go party, all those kind of things. The way I tell you, this my cap shot. Cool way there, so I did. <laughs> this cap not three, you want. If it's waiting there inside. So, no, normally, I be, I be, I be like stay inside. Indoors, I be indoor person. I know they like come off for house. Even in Nigeria, I talk more of UK, we cold day. So, the day when it hit me well, well, now on Christmas day of that year. Hmm. I woke up on Christmas day. Normally before, if I not travel, but I go visit people around. You know that kind of thing now? Uh, I must see one or two when I go visit around. Now, they don't close the country. They say make everybody sit down inside their ass. I was alone. I was lonely. I could not cook because if I cook, who go shop? I know they shop like that. So, if I cook, I'm who go shop? I'm. I know cook. Ah, I can't sleep. When I wake up in the afternoon, I got so bored. Tears come off of my eyes. I said, lie, lie. No, no, no. I go remarry. You know what I just reason? I can't reason say. So there's going to be a day in my life where these children, while they run around, kitty, kitty, kata, kata, kitty, kutu, kutu, kutu. If you see me and my children, everything while they do around them, oh, I they plan my life around them. Anywhere they go, I they plan my life around them. I saw a day will come. We are these children, we all grow up and live. My third child will soon be 10. In no distant time, they don't go. So when they leave, what now happens to me? So this life when I come now, come the life, marry, marriage no work, born children, train the children, take care of this, my club like, oh, take care of the children and that is the end of my life. Mbano. I said, no, it's not going to happen that way. I am going to remarry. I am going to remarry, and I'm a singer for my children. You say, I will remarry, but not now. I'm not going to marry now because I don't want to share one. I don't want to share my love. 
I don't want to share my attention. I have too many things going on in my life now. I have focus. I have targets in front of me. And uh, my children need to grow up too. So for now, I am not going to remind. But they should know that a day will come when I will introduce somebody to them and tell them that I'm going to get married to this person. Maybe that time they may be in high school. Maybe some of them must have moved to uni, whatever. I don't know when. I won't be ready until I am ready. I don't know if you understand that phrase. I must be ready. I go cross my teeth and dot all my eyes. No making mistake again, you know. So the first one was not a mistake. It's just, I believe it's just, just the way God wants it. I don't want to say negativity in anything that I, I am doing or I've done. So, um, Pepe's children, Osako's children, not allowing their mother to get married and their mother accepting it is a consensus, but I no go do them. In the Nigeria, it is easy for her. She be she they go location. She they people there house. The house is busy. Even if she won't get man friend, she go get the man friend. She feel go meet the man friend. You know those kind of things. Children feel not even understand where she go. The only difference between she no remarry. But in the year, if you if you want to do the partnership, is that how you they stay with the person or the person they stay with you? Uh -huh. Yeah, you know they forbid that man fit pack come woman house, woman fit pack go my house. There's there's no uh saying as that they do want mm -mm. you can it can happen anyway, you know. So Pepe's case is different. So people shouldn't use that yastic. They judge all women because everybody gets in home for body. Some women fit stay, you know, there is high and low libido. Some women fit stay for years or forever. Some women even they they very young, they never even marry, and they don't even want to. So not even want near man. They don't want me man to touch them. They don't like them. You know we have different body mechanism, and uh, we different different libido. You know, some people cannot stay for even one week without having sleepover with a man. Why some people can stay very long without having sleepover, and it's not going to. They're not going to reason, and they're not going to think. Um. Living in the Obodo Ibo country, where would they wear? How many layers are we here now? Two for bottom before this one, before this one. Not be saying I'm fine, this one too fine, but I'm ready to take pad down. Now it make me like this one. You know, this my cap, now double pad in my trousers, I wear a double. You will not be wearing this kind of clothes. Only you, when you jump for bed, the bed go cold as like water. There is no warming up. <laughs> there is no warming up. Person go leave it up. Who now we can't? That begin our service week. <laughs> I don't spoil you. I don't spoil. I'm just talking. People are different, yeah. The way they talking, another woman visited their abroad. We talk, say, I know, you know, once by again, oh, I'm okay. I want to focus on my career. I want to face my career. I'm done with men. That's fine. That's fine. You know, we have our choice. We have our opinion. It's fine. Mama G did her own. It was fine for her. And uh, maybe if person, when I say person, they Nigeria, person would think go that way. But in their abroad, they would do like this. So my children know they are as they ask quiet like ice water. All of them don't go to school. Let me know. Coffee, coffee, now they drink. And I see strong like this. Now, when I don't old, I pata pata go back to Nigeria. Because I cannot stay in this Obodo Ibo country and stay in a lo lonely like that. My old age cannot be lonely. Instead of my old age to be lonely, I will carry the skills and all the things what I don't learn for the abroad. Can I go get there for Nigeria? Go and stay with them. And maybe just build an orphanage and stay with children there or something. Just give back to my society. That's the truth. And that's, I think that's what Mama G is doing. That's what's keeping her going. Because if you stay in the abroad, anything you want to do must be license, must be this, must be that, must be, you know, the policing too many. But in the Nigeria, it's flexible. If I'm not fit for big city, I'll go my village. My village get plenty, plenty land. You know, there is always a way. You go meet umunwa, umuna, umuada, any who, any yeah. You, you know, people day, people day to live the life with. But in the abroad, it's too lonely. It's too lonely. You get one charity where they volunteer for. Do you know the thing I do in that charity? The only thing I do in that charity is to carry phone and call old people that are home alone, lonely. Call them, how are you today? How are you doing? Have you done your laundry? Do you have grocery in your house? Who is coming around today? Where are you going today? Just follow them, talk. They just the go follow them, talk. That is the, the apex or the peak of loneliness. When you know if you get people to follow, talk. You can't get people... To, Nigeria, if you don't want to go talk, they go carry talk, come it inside your ass. You will run from talk. You don't understand? So instead of me to stay in a, in a place where they say, I'm not going to marry, should not come up for us, or let me go call day like that. 
enough here happen. I can say happen. So my people, in conclusion of all the things so I talk so, Mama G not getting married again. No me say na she only pass. Or the woman will go marry again. No me say na she bad pass. Everybody gets their reason why they do what they do. What do you think? What is your opinion? Make a error for the comment section. I not be bad. I not be bad girl. I not be naughty girl. I'm good girl. I'm a good girl. Just be say good day. Understand? Good day. <laughs> have a have a nice day. Bye bye. <laughs>